Jesus is alive, he's not dead. Many people around me that Jesus Christ is dead, but he's alive. And he's here for you today. He's sending princes into the city center to tell you about his grace, about his love. Jesus Christ is knocking on the door of your heart. And he's not willing to condemn you. Jesus Christ is not here to destroy you. Jesus came into the world to set you free from your sin. Sin separates you from God. That's why there is a basis of judgment. Judgment is not a spiritual is serious. Even all for those who die upon in the sin will be judged. But Jesus came into the world to take away the sins of the world. If you repent of your sin, forsake your wicked way, trust in the Lord Jesus Christ, and you shall find yourself in heaven and not in the lake of fire. Don't be wise in your own eyes. This world is foolishness. Everything that you have gained in this life will fade away and make it very soon because we're running out of time. This is the day of salvation. This is the day that God's told you to come out of the darkness. What you will gain if you lost your soul. Your soul is eternal. You all have an undying soul. Your soul is in darkness. And if you don't come to the light, Jesus Christ, your soul will remain in darkness. Come to the Lord Jesus Christ. This is the day. And if you never make a decision for Jesus, don't be delayed. Don't make it for tomorrow, but do it today. The, tomorrow is no guarantee. This is the day that your heart is beating. But every heartbeat you have, Jesus Christ is knocking on the door of your heart. He's not willing that you can perish for eternity. He's calling you to come out of the darkness. Come to the Lord Jesus Christ. We are here for you to help you, to pray for you. If you have any addiction, if you have any illness, come forward because Jesus is able to restore you, to set you free by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Yeah. The Bible said, unless you are born again, you cannot see but understand the things of God. And that's why it is important that you have to be acknowledge that Jesus Christ wants to forgive you, that Jesus Christ is the only one who can set you free. I cannot save you, my friend. You cannot save yourself. There is a Savior giving among men, and His name is Jesus, this wonderful Savior. He loves you. He's not against you. He's for you. And He's calling you. But you have to come to Him. You are not saved by His grace because He died. No. He's calling you to come to Him. And if you are willing, and, if, and you are sincere to receive Jesus into your heart, you get the deposit of the Holy Spirit, and then you are marked for eternity. So it means no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. This is the day that you can receive salvation. This is the day that Jesus is calling you. Come on guys, forsake your wicked way. This world will come to an end. But Jesus remains for eternity. Yeah. Hallelujah. Praise Let Manchester be alive. Come out of the darkness. Your spirits are dead. What you will pain if you lost your soul, you can be alive today in Christ Jesus. Jesus gives you a spiritual life. He will set you free from every sin, from every addiction. Jesus Christ is able and is willing. My friends, don't go to hell. Don't be wise in your own eyes. You and me, we all have an undying soul. We don't die. The only thing that's dying is the body. And then you will face the other side of eternity. Listen, my friends, come to the Lord Jesus Christ and you will find salvation. Come to the Lord Jesus Christ and you will find peace and joy. Real peace, not peace from the world, because this is all false, false peace. There is no peace in this world. It's all fake away. It's fake, my friends. That's why right, for all days we're watching. Come to the Lord Jesus Christ. Make a decision for Jesus. What you will gain if you lost your soul, my friends. You have an old dying soul and you need Christ into your lives. And that's why we are here. And this is a wonderful day of grace that God sends preachers into the city center. Do you know why? Because he's not willing that somebody here in Manchester get Paris. He wants that everybody comes to him. To bow your knees and acknowledge that you have sinned and that you cannot save yourself. Jesus is the Savior and this wonderful Savior. He loves you. And if there's somebody here in Manchester today, who want to receive Jesus Christ as the Savior. Is there somebody here today who acknowledges that he has sinned against God? That he needs a Savior? That we are here for you today. 
not to condemn you, but to help you, to bring you into the presence of God, to bring you into his relationship, not by religion, but by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. God bless you, groups. Be aware that there is a judgment day. Be aware that you don't die. And be aware that there is a Savior today. And this Savior is preaching here today in Manchester. So don't be wise, don't be a fool. But what you will gain if you lost your soul? You can be dead tomorrow and find yourself in a lake of fire. And this is not a fairy tale, man. That is a serious story. Praise God. Wake up.